What does the gospel tell us about the activity of Jesus? Why did Jesus's family consider him out of his mind? How does Jesus invite us to participate in the bigger family? All these questions and more answered during today's episode of Daily Reflections. The gospel today is very short. There are only two verses. It speaks about two things. about the great activity of Jesus up to the point of not even having time to eat and the contrary reaction of the family of Jesus up to the point of thinking that he was out of his mind the gospel emphasizes the activity of Jesus Jesus returned home his home is now in Capernaum he is no longer living with his family in Nazareth people knowing that Jesus was in the house they went there such a crowd of people gathered there that he and his disciples did not even have the time to eat calmly the intensity of the ministry of jesus is brought out by the assertion that he and his disciples could not even eat the crowds were claiming jesus attention as though they owned him they expected him to be there for them all the time and then we see the conflict with his family The family of Jesus are aware of what is happening and have concluded that things have gone too far. He needs to be restrained, protected from himself as well as from the people. They think he is out of his mind and he is crazy. Besides, traditional societies have placed a high priority on family honor. Jesus was threatening to bring this honor to his family if he continued to act in such a foolish way. Jesus family would be tainted by his arrogance. One of the most painful experiences for any person is to be let down by the nearest and dearest ones. With Jesus being mobbed all day by the crowds, eager for his message and for his help, his family were caught off guard. They just couldn't get their heads around the vast change introduced into their everyday world by this new movement, namely the preaching of God's kingdom. Sometimes The urgent claims of the kingdom can turn our everyday world upside down. And then we see that Jesus emphasizes the wider family. Jesus gives the example when his relatives get to Capernaum and try to take hold of him to take him back home, he reacts. Instead of remaining closed up in his small family, he extends the family. He creates the community. He asks the same to those who want to follow him. families cannot close up in themselves the excluded and the marginalized should be accepted once again into the community and in this way they feel accepted by god this is the part to be followed in order to attain the objective of the law which said let there be no poor among you just like the great prophets jesus tries to strengthen and affirm community life in the villages of galilee he takes the profound sense or significance of the clan of the family of the community like an expression of the incarnation of the love of god in the love towards neighbor here are some points for a personal reflection does the family help participation in the christian community or does it make it difficult what can all this tell us concerning our relationships in the family and in the community what do i need to be emptied of in order to be fully available to god these points can be of great help to reflect on today's gospel and if you like our reflection do share the good news of our lord have a good day and may god bless you all amen